The executive base slated for second reading seeks to address food security and shortage through the establishment of three campuses of the college across the three senatorial districts of the state. Leader of the House, Roland Asoro, who kicked off the debate, urged members to support the bill. As when passed, it would provide the state and federal government the needed expertise and manpower to ensure food sufficiency and address other ecological and environmental factors. Other lawmakers also spoke in favor of the bill, pointing out that with specialized campuses of agriculture at Igoriaki, College of Marine Technology at Genebode, and College of Forestry and Environment at Uromi. The proposed college will train specialists and create more jobs in the agriculture value chain. This bill, when passed into law, will seek to address the issue of food shortage. Mr. Speaker, this bill seeks to establish an institution that will provide the state and the country the most needed manpower. It's a vast scale acquisition. The government is trying to direct the young ones to go areas for the future where they need to develop skills. We must think about seriously the issue of our environment and we preserve it. At a time when the federal and state governments are thinking of life without oil, agriculture, is a whole. And that is the foundation of my contribution. I have looked at this bill critically. I have seen that it will help the development of agriculture in our state and to be economy. For me, I am convinced that with agriculture, with the development of agriculture in this country, the sky will be our own. Summing up deliberations, the Speaker, Mr. Frank Okie, while emphasizing the importance of the bill, deferred debate on it to the next adjourned date for further legislative activities. So it tends to deal with the issue of establishment of a school spread across the three central districts in three different sectors. So we are to members to deal excessively this bill pull out the experts that will be favorable to society and where necessary if you have something on the reservation. The Speaker also set up an ad hoc committee chaired by the Deputy Speaker, Prince Yekini Idiaye, to review the rules of the House. Sitting continues. Kingsley Uchebu reporting.